hey y'all welcome back to my channel um i have a busy weekend it's memorial weekend memorial day weekend but my sister's baby shower is this weekend and my dad came out here my cousins um <clears throat> Their TV is like really loud. My cousin, some family. And yeah, we're gonna um do that. I have to, today I'm gonna show y'all how to bleach a wig because some people been asking me for that, I think. I don't even remember. But y'all. Yeah. I switched my back, well I didn't switch my bathroom around but I bought new stuff as you can see. I used to have a black thing right here. This nobody's supposed to use this towel. This is a for decoration only, and somebody used it, but it's okay. But I put that there. It looks so cute. I put that on the toilet rack. Let me switch it. I got this little thing here. It's cute. I got this thing here. I got that, this, this I'm gonna change because it doesn't go. I'm gonna get like a color, like this color for the curtains, the rugs. I gotta sweep those rugs, they look crazy. And this, that I'll probably leave there. And then I put this, I put a plant in here and then I got these. This was supposed to have a different sticker, but they didn't send it to me so I have to get a replacement, but yeah. So yeah, yeah. Um, the wig I'm gonna be installing today is by Icy Hair. Um, this is my first time using their hair, but as the looks of it, it's very cute. Like it's very soft, very bumpy, and they gave me all these goodies, which I'm about to open with y'all right now. These cute freaking lashes. That um, the freaking case it came in, so cute. And then they gave me some hair pins. It's like flowers, I think. Oh, butterflies, butterflies. It was like a pink and blue butterfly. And they gave me a scrunchie. I'm sorry if y'all hear. Oh, and an elastic band. I'm sorry if y'all hear the planes in the background. But my mom lived close by the airport. But And they gave me some pressed ones. They were cute, but I don't really wear a pressed one. I got a, um edge brush, wig cap, and a cute, cute bonnet. They is not playing. They giving you everything you need which is really cute like they really show how much they appreciate their customers by doing that yeah that is cute you feel me i got my, my what is that mongolian mongolian hair as you can see i can't read but it's really cute i love curly hair there's mad soft and bouncy and the lace well, you i'm gonna show the lace it's like there's lace there i promise you watch yeah it's like it's so freaking cute but them knots need some bleaching. All right, so on to the bleaching part. What you want to do is you want to put your wig on your wig head um, upside down like how I'm doing it and make sure there's no flyaways. Um, you're going to see that I keep doing this because the hair kept moving back. I don't know what was going on, but she was not trying to stay down. The reason why you don't want no flyaways is because you don't want to bleach, like get bleach on the hair and then the hair freaking bleaches. You hear me? Especially because this is a black wig. But um, a lot of times, y'all, okay, I'm going to tell y'all this now. The way I do it is like it over, I feel like I be over bleaching it. But okay, so you're going to use these two things. I be over bleaching it, but I don't care because it comes out better and then I just, um, just um use a black dye to fix it but it's easier for me like that but if you want to do it this is how I, i'm gonna do i do i did two weeks so this is how i do it i put some powder in there um some of the developer but a lot of people well the videos i've seen they say to make it like a toothpaste consistency like a thick thick consistency but I'll be doing it like a little bit watery. Not like watery, watery. You're going to see. I think I'll show it in a second. Yeah, like, matter of fact, not like that. I think I put more in it. Yeah, I did put more in it. It's like, y'all going to see. When I do it like this, 
it bleaches way easier and then the other one i bleached look like y'all yeah, gonna see but you're just gonna want to um Put the bleach on like how I'm doing, nice and soft. Don't be doing it all crazy because then it's going to leak into the um, hair and then it's going to bleach the whole roots and stuff. So just do it nice and soft and make sure you get it all over. Yeah, I think I put a little too much on there. I done messed up. But after, you're going to take it off the head and then put some foil on it. Like how I'm doing there. I think I took way too much foil. But um, put it like how I'm doing it. And then I think you leave it for like 25 minutes or until you see. You see how they're like black right there still? Until you see that it's like changing color. But this is, I'm showing y'all how I did the other one. Y'all going to see the difference like towards the end of how they look this one i did it like more of a thicker i did the um bleach more like a thicker consistency and the other one was a little bit more like watery well not watery but yeah like that you saw the other one then you saw that one so yeah Now, as I'm waiting for the stuff to um sit, I'm sitting here chilling with Nori. Y'all, remember the bed I made them? He loves that bed, but all they do is make a big old mess on the bed, and I have to clean it every freaking night. And look, one of them was chewing on the side. It's like, they can't have nothing. I can't make them nothing. I wanted him to give me paw, but he freaking biting me like bro well not biting him, but he thought i had sign but um as you can see it's done this is what i'm talking about you see how like this one is still black dots and the other one is like like it went through you're gonna see yeah like you could tell the difference it's been the same time too so i don't know why it does that but then you're gonna um clean your knots with this purple shampoo and wash the hair like how you would wash like your regular hair I washed it and it's gonna look like blonde at the bottom and look giving very much scalp um that's how it's supposed to look the other one you're gonna see 
how the other one looks. It's like very, like it looked like I didn't even bleach it at all. Like it bleached a little bit, but not really. You can see all them dots still. And I'm be honest with you, I'm not gonna bleach bleach it again because then I have to wash the hair again and do all that again. And I'm not doing that. I'll probably just put some makeup on it. But this one is definitely giving scalp. The other one, hopefully, when I put the makeup on it, it doesn't look that bad. But that's just me. I feel like it comes out better. Like if you do it with a thicker um, bleach, it's gonna come out like that. But with a um, more liquid bleach, it'll come out like you don't have to do it twice. I feel like with a thicker one, you'll have to do it twice. So this is how I pluck my hair. Basically, you're just gonna take a thin layer and part it, take some out in the front. If you see that little piece right there, it was bothering me when I was watching the video. I didn't part part of it. But you're going to take a thin layer and then just pluck, 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 pluck. You're going to do it slow and not so rough or else you're going to make holes in the lace. I be doing that sometimes because I get impatient. And I be making holes in my lace sometimes. But you got to be careful and make sure you're moving your hand. Do not stay in one place. At, do not stay in one place or else you're going to give your, your wig a bald spot. And you don't want that. But pluck your hair how you want to pluck it. Don't let nobody tell you. Oh, you need to pluck it more. You need to pluck it less. It's about how you want your hair to look. Some people pluck a lot. Some people pluck a little bit. Some people don't pluck at all. If you like it, baby, do your thing. It's your wig. You wearing it, okay? This is how I like my hair. Or sometimes, sometimes I be too lazy to pluck and um, I just do it while it's dry. It's way easier, though, to pluck um, when the hair is wet because like, it comes out easier. I don't know. But it's just way easier to do it while it's wet. When it's dry, it's like it's just too much. But after you did it like after you parted like three times, this is how it's gonna look. So nice and cute. Giving very much scalp. I freaking love it. I love curly hair. I don't know why curly hair. I don't know why I love curly hair so much, but I freaking love it. And then I have to do the top. Basically, you just do the top and the whole thing, the same thing. But I feel like me, I don't do too much at the top. Because when you look at natural hair, um, I feel like the sides is plucked more and then the top is not that plucked. But if you like the top plucked, you could do it. Baby, it's your hair. Do what you please, okay? I finished plucking but I feel like it needed to be a little bit more so I just I didn't part it I just started plucking a little bit like that and I feel like it did look a little bit better yeah that's how I like it but yeah I'm done with this one y'all looks so freaking cute so freaking nice all plucked I'm gonna um I kept looking at the top because I'm thinking like should I pluck it more or should I just leave it but it's cute um I'm gonna probably install it tomorrow I'll make a video installing it and wearing it and stuff show you how it looks but for the most part it's really really cute i love you guys i'll see you later